Hello everybody, Dr. Demelza here with another Enrichment Innovation segment and no mouse because I'm in the building by myself. So today I want to talk about what we call a container board and this is again made out of familiar everyday objects. This is just a cutting board, you can get them in all sorts of sizes and colours. This is a fairly thick sturdy one. We prefer to use this type of material over say wood because wood splinters this is also much easier to clean and less likely to harbor bacteria. So we like the cutting board material. Now what we've done here is to simply screw on some containers. Our, we choose containers with screw on or clip on lids so that it makes it easy for keepers to fill and then also the lids not likely to pop off. Now we have to drill holes into the container board because this side is actually what the animal sees. So we drill an appropriate size hole into the container board using a, a hole cutting bit and then we would attach the containers to the other side. Again, we would have to drill the same size hole in the bottom of the container. We have to be kind of careful when we use these plastic tubs because they can split and crack so we need to be careful of that. Once we've drilled holes, we always sand everything down so that the edges are nice and smooth for a tongue or a fingers that get in there. And then we simply attach them onto the container board using a bolt and again our lock nuts so that they come off. And again, this is what the animal sees. We would fill this with some kind of dietary item and the animal has to get the item out. Now this is particularly good for something like the giraffe because they have very long tongues so nice big size containers on the other side are great for them and this particular board is actually for the gibbons so some of the primates do very well with these because gibbons particularly have nice long slender fingers and so they can easily get in there and get their food out and so again it adds an extra layer of complexity for when they are foraging, feeding, and they have to figure out first of all that there's something in there to get and then go in and get the object. So that's basically it. Of course, you could add as many tubs as you wanted to it. And this is what we call a container board and it works really well with giraffe and also some of our primates. So that's our enrichment innovation segment for today. Thanks for watching.